God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Sherry had sent us all the uh, minutes from the last meeting. I didn't see any uh, corrections or anything. Everybody? I just spotted two, which I'm sorry I failed to recognize earlier, but I apparently seconded two motions and I was not present. Later, sorry. Right. At least we brought it to oh, yes, the new issue now. All right. Oh, you know why I didn't change them? because they didn't get um, put out for to uh, approve the minutes. And the uh, engineer and the solicitor. Oh. So we'll have to remember to do that today. Yes. There was no motion. Oh, no. no. Shame on me. So I, don't know, I, I, just, <laughs> I just left it as it was. <laughs> well, that's why you were on that. Okay. Okay. Motion to accept the minutes. I'll make the motion. Second. I'll second. Motion's been made and second. Any questions? Yeah. All in favor signify by saying aye. Uh -huh. Aye. Opposed no. The motion carries. Uh, no correspondence. I don't have anything. Yeah. You don't have anything. No. All right. Review the financial statements. Well, your financial statements I did as the end of October. So the bank has you with a balance of $67,812.56. Today's bills are a total of $803.75. So as of today, it is $67,008.81. Motion to accept the financial report and pay the bills is read. I'll, I'll make the motion. There's a second. Second. second bill. All in favor <coughs> signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed no. Motion carries. Solicitor's report. Anything? Uh, I would see something, but I don't think it really relates to us. I think it might relate to the township. Um, just got this the other day in the mail that um, it's an appeal to the property reassessment that was instituted by Fort Cherry School District and they uh, raise in the property value for tax purposes on some property on Westland Road, 511 Westland Road and it's one's identified as zero Westland Road. I don't know what that means but that'd be the uh, um, But it says it went to Blaine Black, Anthony uh, Jiglio, Jiglio, I don't know who that is, I don't know who and me, is. and I'm thinking that they mistakenly identified me as the township solicitor uh, off of the website. Uh, so right. how about I give that to you? And you all right. I don't think I don't think you need to do anything with it. It's the school district. That is, yeah, I was going to say that sounds like it really needs to go to the school district. Well, <coughs> they they received it for sure. Yeah. But, right. um, I think they sent it to me. I think that happened once several years ago with something also. But other than that, I didn't have any real <laughs> activity. Okay. Engineer's report. All right, thank you. So we have the H2OPA grant program. Uh, applications are due December 21st, so I started putting that together. Uh, reached out to both uh, Dan McKessick with PennVest and Todd Cawley, RUS, both responded back. Uh, <coughs> The H2O projects are uh, up to 20 million. Uh, sorry, make sure it's grants or projects are up to 20 million. I think grants. Grants are up to 20 million. Grants are up to 20 million. Yeah. So uh, looking at the construction, the engineering, the legal, the admin, everything, total project cost is roughly 36 million. So I'm thinking we apply for half, which is the max we're allowed to apply for, which would be 18 million. Uh, so then that 18 million minus the four and a half or i'm sorry the three and a half million dollar grant we have through the stag program uh -huh. uh, puts us at 14.5 million that we would have to finance through either penvest or us or both uh, and even with that we would still need some grant money from both 
uh, both say we're in a good position uh, because of the household income. Uh, Dan McKessick said, let's sit tight on actually submitting to PennVest. Let's, let's get the grant application in. Uh, hopefully, we get the grant, and then we go to PennVest. Then we go to RUS. Oh, wow. But for the application, we need some commitment from those two to finance the the remainder mm. the remainder of the project. So uh, I'm hoping to get some type of generic letter yeah. from both that says it would qualify for the financing, and you know, of course, we would have to go through the process. But it uh, it is a fundable project. Uh, I have to get you draft letters to have uh, the township provide those letters of support for the application. So be doing that over the next couple of weeks, and and uh, there may be a resolution we'll have to adopt yes. in December. We so we'll do that early in December, and a hundred dollar application fee, which we'll provide, and and that's pretty much it. So yeah, like I said, this is the big one. This is the one we need. Yeah. So. Shouldn't you also get letters of support from like your state representatives? Or Nevada, yeah. Jace, yes, yes, all of them. Okay. Even the county? Yes, yeah. yes, all of them. Okay. So, so, but that's all I have for this evening. All right, that's uh, that's a big project. I mean, that's that could either put us a, in a go uh, yeah. or no go. Uh, yeah, uh, I mean, that's really what one. it comes down to. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but I found it interesting. I got a thing from uh, PSATS. Oh yeah, and I forward that to you. Yes, that there was some grants. Oh yes, yeah, one out. in Washington, and County. there was uh, up in Butler County, I wasn't it? I saw those. I I thought of those. Thirty million dollars or something like that, and Washington County got zero. Yeah, not one thing. But the one thing that was important with those is that those communities that got it were under DEP enforcement orders. And when the DP oh, well, like steps you. on you, that's when all of a sudden the funding shows up. Uh, and that'll come in handy on the PennVest application yeah. because you do get extra points when they when they rate the projects. You get bonus points if you're under an order. Yeah, okay, <laughs> absolutely. You, they, they put you under an order and all of a sudden that's yeah. when the money shows up. Isn't that interesting? I've seen right. it before. <laughs> yes. So, well, hey, we're just going to keep plugging away. Um, let me know what we need from the township. Yes, for sure. And, uh, yep. Go from there if you need anything else. Yes, perfect. Thank you. All right. Can I have a motion to accept the solicitor's and engineer's report? <laughs> <laughs> Please. I'll make a motion. Thank you. Is there a second? I'll second. Motion's been made and second. Any questions? <laughs> All in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed, no. Motion carries. So we got the permitting, we just talked about the fan financing. Um, I don't have any other new business, anybody have anything? Can I bring something up? You sure can. You know, I think what you need to look at now. Um, as I was sitting today and I did my own and I'm doing transferring to a different bank now, maybe back to your local Washington financial bank. I don't have a problem with that. Only because, obviously, we all know interest rates are going up. $7,000, you're getting zero for that money in the bank through First, what is it? <clears throat> first National Bank? Yeah, First Bankers or whatever it is. I don't have a problem. FNB, First National Bank. Yeah, yeah. Washington Financial, we get interest on all of our accounts. You get something. Every account. Not a lot, but you do get something. Oh, it's climbing. No, it's climbing. <laughs> It's climbing. I don't know. I mean, I'll give you just a, a quick little, for instance, the, the money that, and I add into it every month, and I put a little more, and when when we get to the point we can just pay it off, it's for PennVest. I only have, like, I want to say, like, last month I earned $168 in interest. I mean, so you earn a hundred bucks on your right. 60 some thousand. I mean, it's something better than right. nothing. Right, absolutely. If it so, pays one little bill, it pays I mean, one little bill. You think about it. Yep. Um, it's just a thought, and it's right down the road instead of Bridgeville. I'll, uh, I'll make a motion that we uh, look into, and if it's feasible, move the uh, checking account from the current bank to Washington Financial. I'll second that motion. Motion has been made and second. Any questions? 
All in why, favor. Why was it changed to begin? Because they had the they the had loan. The, the loan you had the, yeah, the yeah. line of credit loan. And now that yeah. that's gone, now that's there's gone. no reason. Can, yeah. There's nothing holding you there. Right. All in favor signify by saying aye. Uh -huh. Aye. Opposed, no. Motion carries. All right. Being no other new business, the next meeting will be December the 7th here at the uh, Lovely Township office. And then I'll make a motion we adjourn. I'll second. Motion been made and second. All in favor signify by saying aye. Aye. aye.